the biggest mega projects in the world. Some of the biggest projects the world has seen are staggering in scale, funding, and complexity. And you will be surprised to know how much goes into bringing these projects to reality. Before getting a nod, a mega project must meet a unique set of circumstances. As you will imagine, there is no shortcut to constructing a mega project that would change the course of history. Every mega project should be designed and constructed from a grounds up approach amidst considerable criticism from local and international borders. And with massive risks, criticisms, and immense cost overruns, these projects often proceed to completion. Designers, architects, and builders of mega projects embrace the unknown and forge ahead with their task despite the drawbacks. We all know how much successful mega projects can achieve. They're pinnacles of human accomplishments and spectacles. For instance, think about how much the International Space Station has accomplished. Imagine the number of criticisms, risks, and challenges the project had to deal with. And that is the case with most mega construction projects. In today's video, I will tell you about some of the most outstanding mega projects this world has ever seen. As usual, remember to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. The International Space Station The International Space Station is by far the biggest man-made structure in space. The project was a partnership between 15 countries and 5 space agencies. Its construction kicked off in 1998 with a budgeted cost of 60 billion US dollars. Piece by piece, the space station was sent into space. It was gradually constructed in orbit, 400 meters above the Earth's surface. The entire project has taken 40 missions to build and currently consists of 15 pressurized modules. The International Space Station weighs almost 400 tons, covering an area as large as a standard football pitch. It circles the Earth every 92 minutes at a speed of 28,000 kilometers per hour. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor ITER, is an energy project between 35 countries. The project is currently under construction on a 180 hectares site in southern France. Once the construction of the project is finished, it will become the world's largest tacomac. The whole project has been designed to prove the feasibility of the fusion of large-scale and carbon-free sources of energy based on the same principle that powers the sun. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor and Plant System are housed in 39 buildings and technical areas. The core of the project, the Tacomac facility, is a seven-story structure. The building is made of reinforced concrete sitting 13 meters below the platform level and 60 meters above. The construction of the vast facility kicked off in 2013. The whole project required the development of 10 different concrete types to protect workers from radiation. The 20 billion US dollar project is set to come online in 2025. The Al Maktoum International Airport of Dubai. As we know, Dubai is home to record breaking projects such as the Burj Khalifa skyscraper. And you would expect such an ambitious city and magnificent city to have a proper airport facility. The scale of the Al Maktoum International Airport of Dubai is utterly extraordinary. The facility extends over 34 kilometers and is designed to handle over 200 wide-body aircraft at a go. The airport is also projected to handle over 220 million passengers annually. Although the project was originally scheduled for completion in 2018, the completion date for the latest expansion phase is still not known. The Chuo Shinkansen, Japan one of Japan's latest and largest mega-projects is the high-speed rail line, referred to as the Chuo Shinkansen. The rail line project is being constructed in phases. Construction works kicked off in the year 2015. The rail line will take travelers from Tokyo to Nagoya, a distance of about 286 kilometers. The driverless magnetic levitation train project will become the fastest train in the world. Electromagnetic technology lifts the train's cars about 10 centimeters above the tracks as it travels. More than 90% of the rail line is constructed underground. This design is called for a lot of extensive tunnel construction. The project's first phase will involve the construction of a 286 kilometers of superconductive maglev line. The line will comprise 257 kilometers of tunnel, 24 kilometers of viaducts, and 11 kilometers. 
This project will also incorporate six stations and a train depot. The construction of the project has been marred with lots of challenges and delays, especially in areas where excavation is complex. The first phase is estimated to cost about 52 billion US dollars and is expected to be operational in 2027. However, because of too many challenges, the date looks almost unlikely. The next construction phase will extend the rail line to Osaka. Great Garuda, Jakarta, Indonesia Did you know Jakarta, the capital of Indonesia, is the fastest sinking city in the world? Well, now you know. The city is home to over 36 million residents and is sinking at the rate of 5 to 10 centimeters annually due to excessive flooding. Without a mega project to protect it, Jakarta will wholly sink by 2050 and its entire population will be displaced. The National Capital Integrated Coastal Development Master Plan to protect the city is set to cost over 40 billion US dollars. The project will involve the construction of a massive 32 kilometer seawall called the Great Garuda. The seawall will take the shape of a mythical bird. The construction of the seal wall is already underway. Although several hitches have caused significant delays, the whole project is set to be completed by 2025. Strategic Master Plan, Sao Paulo, Brazil The Sao Paulo Strategic Master Plan is a project intended to upgrade Brazil's biggest city. The project aims to promote people-oriented and sustainable development, including 717,000 new residential homes, wider pavements, dedicated bus and cycle lanes, and numerous green spaces. It is estimated that over 1.2 million residents of Sao Paulo reside in favelas, concrete and iron shanty towns, or abandoned buildings downtown called cortices. The strategic master plan intends to build 240,000 affordable residential units. The plan has been set to be completed by 2030. The Great Man-Made River Project of Libya the Great Man-Made River Project of Libya has been a work in progress since 1985. It is considered the world's largest irrigation scheme. When completed, the project will deliver irrigation water to over 350,000 acres of agricultural land. Aside from the irrigation scheme, the project also intends to serve Libyan residents with clean water. The Burj Khalifa Skyscraper the Burj Khalifa is the world's tallest building. It has a total height of 829 meters. Burj Khalifa is the centerpiece of a larger development project encompassing residential places, shopping, and office spaces. Construction works of the Burj Khalifa kicked off in 2004. The exterior works were completed five years later in 2009. The primary structure is reinforced concrete. Over 211,000 of concrete have been poured and over 145 concrete piles laid at depths of over 72 meters to ensure the stability of the building. The foundation of the building was designed to support the total building weight, which stands at approximately 450,000 tons. These are just some of the many big projects the world has ever seen. More projects are still underway, and we will keep you posted with all the details as we get them. What is your take on these projects? What do you think are their economic and social implications? Share your opinion in the comments section.